At London's National Gallery, one of the world's most iconic paintings is about to become unrecognisable. After throwing tomato soup over Vincent van Gogh's masterpiece, the two activists stuck their hands to the wall. What is worth more, art or life? Are you more concerned about the protection of a painting or the protection of our planet? It's a growing trend. In July, protesters stuck their hands to a painting by Botticelli in Florence. And earlier in May, a man pretending to be disabled smeared the Mona Lisa with cake in Paris's Louvre Museum. Each protest is painstakingly choreographed and filmed, but the protagonists are struggling to get public opinion on their side. It's always ridiculous to attack symbols. I don't understand what it achieves apart from making a buzz. I understand the point because it gets people talking, but I don't think it helps people fighting for the environment to get closer to the goals. But for some environmentalists, these kinds of stunts are the best way to draw attention to their cause. They're attacking something that's sacred in a way. So right now, their aim is to multiply the potential targets, to spread the word and get as many people talking about the environment as possible. For now, the works targeted have all been protected by glass covers. So while the frame may need replacing, this time Van Gogh's sunflowers have escaped intact.